I'm on a roof in Greenwich, Connecticut, and this is a torch down roof. But there's one leak and we found it. And the leak is right here. Let me show you. Very hard to find leaks on these roofs. You see the bubble, the, the crease here? And the water goes into this crease and then it starts leaking. So what you do is you clear all the loose granules off of it. Okay. There's loose granules there. You gotta That's it. And then what you do is you wanna put a uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix it with turbo poly seal. Let me show you. Turbo poly seal, okay. And um, what you do is you just brush just brush turbo poly seal right there over the seam just like that just like that and I'm gonna do up to there and up to there as I bring it up to there and that whole seam I'm fixing a seam on a torch down roof okay so making it four inches wide just like that four inches wide beautiful see that and then I cut my um, fleece the length of that right there I'm fixing a seam on a torch down roof okay so that's it this goes over that seam right there just like that and then you put a coating of uh, turbo over that and that's it you're done you're done okay just like that Just like that, okay? And this is how you fix a seam on a torch down roof. I use turbo poly seal with a fleece and that will never, never go bad. <laughs> fix this quickly with turbo, uh, with turbo poly seal. All you do is, very easy. Cover that area, just like that. So it's simple, but it, it works. Okay, just like that. I'm putting a, a thick coat of turbo. All right, and then I'm going to put a piece of fleece. Cut myself a piece of fleece. Just like that. All right. I put it over that area. And my repair is done. This is a unbelievable product it works good and I make sure I cover the fleece because the, the UVs will break it up and this repair is done all right so hold on so when you do a repair with the white sand on a, on a membrane roof you can also use the same um, granulars let me show you. you. Make the same granulars, but you have to do it right after you smear the uh, paint the uh, turbo poly seal. You can put some gr white granular sand over that to protect it against UVs. Let me show you. So that's all you do. Check that out. Look how nice that is. Okay? So.
And then this is protected against ultraviolet, so you don't have to paint it with uh, super silicone, I mean with silver coat protection. Very nice. This is what a turbo poly seal transition looks like after two years. You can see we covered with sand, but it looks very good after two years. All right, same here. You can see after two years, you can see it sticks to the brick. Very good, and the transition, excellent, excellent, excellent. After two years. All right, thank you for watching.